back in February, Neil was fortunate enough to uh, uh, participate in his first piano competition at Texas State University in San Marcos, Texas. And there were some really phenomenal young pianists that we got to see and uh, listen to and play along with um, in this competition coming from other cities such as Austin, Waco, San Antonio. I believe there were some from Dallas and Houston as well. And Neil was fortunate enough to uh, come away with the second prize in his uh, age division. So really proud of his accomplishments. <laughs> similar successes in the, in the future. Um, one of the pieces that he played for that competition was this etude in G major by uh, German composer Moritz Moskowski, of Polish descent also. Um, it's a relatively short piece in comparison, especially to that Mozart sonata that we just listened to. Um, uh, but uh, uh, for those of you who don't know what an etude is, an etude is an exercise. So it's an exercise to work on a particular skill at the piano, and this one I think the skill is pretty obvious that it's to work on scale-like works, but at the same time there's this tradition in, in both, not just piano, but in other musical instruments where an etude is also a chance for a composer to show off some, uh, not just the particular skill, but also how musical they can be also at the piano, and I think this is a nice demonstration of it here. Um, one of, my, one of my responsibilities here at Stephen F. Austin State University is to teach the group piano classes and uh, I teach multiple students at the same time and we have this visualizer and also this program that I use, Classroom Maestro, uh, which actually facilitates a lot of the um, playing that, uh, or the teaching that I do because everything that I play at my teacher uh, digital piano is demonstrated on the screen behind me and even the pedals change and you even see it on the uh, 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 treble and bass staff, and it's interesting watching some of the students in the lab. They're kind of have their eyes, you know, focused in on 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 this visualization that I'm playing. And some of them are sitting here in the audience there. Um, <coughs> but uh, I think it was like a couple times some of them joked around. You know, that would be really cool to have in in a recital to like have to see that playing. But the only problem is you can't do it on an acoustic instrument. But Fortunately, we have a hybrid instrument here that allows us to connect it to my computer, which is tucked <laughs> behind here. So I thought it'd be interesting to have a nice little bird's eye view of the keyboard to see some of the notes that Neo's playing and also a visualization of what it is on the uh, treble and bass staff. So the, again, this is the etude in G major by Moskowski. Sweden, and uh, this one's a little bit more local. <laughs> this boggy slough is, I believe, a stretch of uh, 
forest not far from Lufkin in Angelina County. Um, Dr. Elias had given me a little bit of insight on why he wrote this piece. Part of it was actually also for a competition for composition um, in Sydney, Australia. Um, part of the conditions of the competition was that in order for, to be eligible for this comp uh, competition, the composers had to write a piece within a 24 hour period. They would have to write out a composition within one day uh, and, and to be eligible for this uh, uh, competition. So he wrote this, what he calls a miniature piano piece. Uh, it's not very long and it's not terribly difficult, at least technically, but there's a real beauty about it uh, as far as the harmonies that he uses and colors, which really challenge a pianist, particularly someone the age of Neo. Um, it was a really good exercise in having him really listen to uh, the sounds that come out of the piano and to uh, pay attention to the sounds and also the sounds that happen in between there. And um, I have some images that uh, were taken by both Dr. Elias and also his wife, Ronnie, um, that I'll be demonstrating that go in conjunction with the piece to kind of get us in the mood as far as the uh, uh, Boggy Slough piece uh, that uh, Dr. Elias has composed. So hope you enjoy Neo's performance of it. 